Hi guys, it's been a month because I'm still getting used to making videos and I'm not very good at them yet. I mean, see, believe it or not, I've actually made three already, but the three I've made, I don't feel comfortable putting them up because I just don't think they're good enough. So maybe when I learn to edit, get some more stuff done, I don't know, learn a bit more about video making practice a few more vlogs, play a few more games and films that I can talk about properly, maybe I'll just do more. But something I can tell you about is Dread. That film is amazing. I have seen it four times in the cinema. Oh, it's that good. Literally every single thing about Dread is perfect. I mean, Carl Urban plays Judge Dread perfectly. The gun, the lawbringer, sorry, correction, the lawgiver is awesome it does everything it's so cool the one thing that's not very good about it is the bike it looks really silly the law bringer that's the law bringer the villain in this movie is named mama and she is awesome in every way shape and form oh i promise never to do any spoilers not about this film this film is too good for spoilers the soundtrack to the film is perfect the way it's shot is amazing, the scenes are great, the slow motion that's used in the film is used perfectly. A lot of people are saying it's a bit too brutal and gory, but I understand where they're coming from. But then again, Judge Dredd was brutal and gory. The way it's done in this film is almost comic in its brutal goriness. It's amazing, it's so good. Another thing I'm talking about is Resident Evil 6. This game is good. It has its faults. There are a lot of quick time events and there are a lot of cutscenes, but the gameplay itself is solid, it's challenging, I was running out of ammo a lot. I've only done one and a bit campaigns so far, because there are three campaigns that have five chapters each, I think, and the game is going to last me over 20 hours at least, because I was up from 8 in the afternoon till 4am, then I turned it off, and then I did like an hour's worth of playing. Uh, from 11 till 12 the next day and that was me finally beating Leon's campaign so it's huge there are six characters unless you include Ada's but I'm not sure who she'd work with so I don't know if that's cooperative or not the whole game is co-op online or not there's a cool mode called agent hunt where you can join another person's game as a zombie or a creature or something and essentially just try and sabotage them and kill them now this sounds like a great idea, and it very much is, but the only problem is is that zombies can be really easily dispatched in this game, and it takes quite a while to get to certain people at times, and when you get there, you normally shot like that, and your head goes away, and then you have to start again with something else. If you're lucky, you'll get like someone who can throw something, or I don't know, monsters, bigger ones. Now, alongside kickboxing, I am now officially studying combat jujitsu, or kick jitsu, I'm not sure if it's the same thing or they're two syllabus mashed into one. That's going to be real fun. Uh, I definitely enjoy being thrown around a lot, so I think I'm going to do a lot more of those classes. I might film that. If I do, it'll be on the internet. I know it's a trope used by a lot of other YouTubers, but I might as well use it as well because it's a good one. If anyone's actually watching this, which I hope you are, um, please answer this question in the comments below. Have you ever been to the cinema to see the same film more than once? And was it deserving? What film was it? And what games are you guys playing right now? Are you playing anything interesting? What? Tell me and I'll talk about them in my next video or something. Bye bye guys.